Alrighty, what's going on guys here? I'm bringing you my longest 1v2 of the whole beta here. So let's start out by uh, going against the Great Axe Easy right here. We're just going to barely dodge both our charges right there. Dodge his reap. And then we're going to look to parry here. We parry the guy's auto. Roll right past him. Pop a fireball here. He barely missed me with his ice shard. Otherwise, I would have been in serious trouble. He's going to hit me with the gravity well, but I roll out. But I was just too slow and we get hit by the slow right there. I want to kite towards this fence right here, try and get over it. We hop over it, create some more distance between me and them. And then the guy's going to hit me with that auto attack. We got stuck on the fence right there, unfortunately. I want to use Burnout right there to go right through both of them. Drink some water, got to stay hydrated. I'm going to use my parry as he closes the gap. I'm going to flush right through him there. And we're going to continue to try and create some distance between me and them. Because I'm desperately right now wanting to find somewhere else to where I can take this fight to a better location which will be easier for me to win. So now we're just gonna look back, poke with the fireball, hit some autos, get some more damage in, and continue to kite uh, backwards. The guy puts his ice shower down and barely misses it. So now we're gonna continue to kite back to these fences here and look to create some distance and get to the place that I wanna be. And I'm gonna choose these fences here since it's some LOS, and they're gonna have to continuously hop over these to fight me. So I'm going to put a fireball in the ground there, but he doesn't come after me, which means I miss it. I'm going to swatch to my flashay here to get right out of that gravity well. Turn to my fire staff there to use burnout, but to no avail, I get cancelled right out of it. Nice cancel by him. I want to hop over that fence here and continue trying to kite back here. Get some more poke in. Hit a nice auto right there. Rolled out as the charge. I'm going to flashay right into this guy. Desperately trying to finish him off here. Evading forward, autoing him down. As he's about to die here, the guy hits me with a nice heavy attack from the Ice Gauntlet, saving his teammate right there. Otherwise, he would have been killed. And we roll right right in the nick of time there, avoiding the Ice Shower. We're continue to hop over these fences and try and create some more distance between me and them. They're going to continue to chase me here. I'm going to use a potion there to get my health back and continue to run them around like, like in the jungle gym here. I got a nice flush into a bunch of backside damage, but I was barely not able to confirm the kill. We're going to look for some autos here. We're going to miss two of them. And since we were stuck in that guy's uh, ice ice shower right there, he's going to continue to hit me for a bunch of heavy attack damage. Since whenever you're in a frosted area and an ice gauntlet user heavy attacks you, you get basically rooted in place for one second and he continuously chains. You see that? So you just take, take a bunch of free damage. So right now we're just kiting back, waiting for my pop to come off. It comes off cooldown. We're going to use that and we're going to continue to try and kite right back into those fences here. We're going to roll dodge that reap there, barely. The guy's going to whiff his gravity well as they're coming towards me. We're going to look for some more poke damage. He pops into his ice tomb. I assume to get more mana back as we look for more auto attacks. We miss our auto attack. He hits me with the charge. I flash right through him, creating more distance between me and them. Don't want to get caught out here in the open. We pop a fireball. He dodges my fireball. I dodge his reap. Nice dodges all around. He pops another ice, ice shower up. I storm. And we're going to... Go right through him. We're going to auto accidentally into his ice shower right there, taking a bunch of free damage here. We're going to try and flush right through it, but to no avail. I did not know how that worked, and I got punished very hard for that. Luckily, I had a potion coming up. As they chase me, we're going to pop a fireball. We're going to get hit by the first beat, roll dodge the second beat, switch to our fire stab, use burnout to create the distance between them, and we're going to pop that nice auto attack right in there to finish the guy off and finally turn the fight in my favor here. So now we're just going to sit back, poke down with our fire staff here, and continue to get the guy lower. As we wait for our potion to come off cooldown, our po we use our potion there, getting our health back, poke, continuously poking this guy down. We poke, hit him with another auto, switch to our rapier into the shape, auto evade combo. He hits me with the reap, but it does not matter, and we're we'll continue to auto and evade him down here. 